I'm taking on every Cinnamon Toast Crunch product on my table. Rule number one, every Cinnamon Toast Crunch item has to be fully consumed. Oatmeal is down in two minutes. Rule number two, I have 60 minutes to consume every item. It took me almost eight minutes to eat that bowl of cereal. That's a problem. If I fail to take down everything in under 60 minutes, then I'm going to have to spend the next 48 hours eating only Cinnamon Toast Crunch. The first step was buying all of the wonderful Cinnamon Toast Crunch items. Before I jump into all of this sugar, it's time to do a little pre-challenge blood sugar check. There we go. Now it's time to make our cinnamon toast crunch deliciousness. Item number one, cinnamon toast crunch center rolls. Out of all the things in this challenge that I was looking forward to trying, these were on the top of my list. I pulled these out of the oven after 15 minutes and topped them with some cinnamon toast crunch icing. The next item on my list was some cinnamon toast crunch pancakes. I whipped up three massive pancakes and then I topped them with some legendary cinnamon toast crunch. And then I topped that with some cinnamon dust. These came out looking pretty spectacular. And now it's time for some donuts but not just any regular donuts, some Cinnamon Toast Crunch donuts. These aren't an official Cinnamon Toast Crunch item, but I feel like they should be. Whew. All right, everybody, it is time to get this week's food challenge officially started. I am so hyped for this challenge because I love Cinnamon Toast Crunch. There is a ton of sugar on this table right now. I don't know how much right now, but at a future point, I'm going to know, and I'm gonna put that right up there for you all to see. I have one, two, three, 14 Cinnamon Toast Crunch items on my table right now including the all new Cinefuego Toast Crunch that just came out. I special ordered this and I'm super excited to get into it. I'm gonna be giving myself a 60 minute time limit to take down all of this Cinnamon Toast Crunch deliciousness. And if I'm unable to complete all of this within the time limit, I'm gonna have to live off of Cinnamon Toast Crunch for 48 straight hours. Good thing I love Cinnamon Toast Crunch. Actually, I'm definitely not gonna be liking it very much after all this. Everyone, there's going to be a ridiculous amount of flavor fatigue going on in this challenge. So my only real strategy is to be able to counteract all the sweetness with something savory. Anyways, Electric Empire, it's time to get into this challenge. Without further ado, let's do this. The first item I'm gonna be starting with is going to be the Cinnamon Toast Crunch Oatmeal. I whipped up a few servings of this in a bowl. All right, everybody, it's time to get this challenge started in three, two, and one. Starting off with some complex carbs. All right, oatmeal is down in two minutes. I give the oatmeal a 6.5 out of 10. Now I'm gonna move on over to the cinnamon toast crunch pancakes, which I'm very much looking forward to. Let's just take a moment to admire that. Oh, you never have too much syrup. Don't worry, it's sugar free. Don't think I didn't come prepared to the party. Always gotta have milk, especially when you're doing a challenge like this. All right, pancakes are down. We are eight and a half minutes in. Can I really not bring any paper towels to the party? I think I'm gonna get into my first box of cereal. I'll go for these Cinnamon Toast Crunch Churros. Oh, nothing like opening a box of them. Cinnamon Toast Crunch. I'll pick that up later. Did you know Cinnamon Toast Crunch is the fifth best-selling cereal in the United States and is the most popular cereal in 54% of those states? Are you a Cinnamon Toast Crunch fan? Right, everybody. It took me almost eight minutes to eat that bowl of cereal. That's a problem. I think those Cinnamon Toast Crunch churros are legendary. I'd give those an eight out of 10. Now we're gonna get on over to the Cinnamon Toast Crunch cereal treats, cinnamon, cereal bar treats. Yeah. That was good. Mm. Cereal treats are down. Those are tasty. I would give those an eight and a half out of 10. Now I was very skeptical when I saw these in the grocery store with Cinnamon Toast Crunch Cinnamon Rolls, everybody. That is something revolutionary. Let's see how it's gonna taste. Three, two, one. Everyone, those are gonna get a dummy. Oh, dummy. Did you know cinnamon can actually help regulate your blood sugar? It can also help lower lipid levels such as LDL cholesterol and triglycerides. Cinnamon rolls are down. 24 minutes into the challenge. Now everybody, I think it's time for me to try out this all new Cinefuego Toast Crunch right here. Woo! Everybody, it smells like a hot tamale. If you don't know what that is, it's basically like a very hot cinnamon candy. 
Sin of Fuego, Toast Crunch. Here we go. Three, two, one. That's got a kick. Oh, I like it though. I need a bit bigger of a cereal bowl. Just a little bit. Size matters when it comes to this kind of stuff. Santa Fuego Toast Crunch is down. Hey everyone, that's gonna get a uh, very hot and spicy out of 10. Woo. Now it's time to head on over to the Cinnamon Toast Crunch Rolls. And that's what they look like right there. This is also a brand new product right here. Let's see how these are gonna taste. Three, two, one. Those are tasty. I'm 34 minutes in, and I'm starting to hit that flavor fatigue. Ooh. By the way, well, the second box of cereal is down for almost 37 minutes in the challenge. Oh my goodness. My mouth is still on fire from that Santa Fuego Toast Crunch. The roof of my mouth is just gonna be feeling so good tomorrow. Oh, and I feel like I forgot to rate past three items. They all fire. The United States cereal industry uses over 400 million kilograms of sugar per year. That's almost 882 million pounds of sugar. That's a lot of sugar. All right, well, popcorn is down. Oh my goodness, we are 44 minutes in. It's about that time, everybody, for some deliciousness. Oh, I just cannot wait for this to enter my body. I love them so much right now. Really nice. Cupcakes are down. We have uh, about 12 and a half minutes left. Now I gotta get on over these tasty looking donuts right here. Oh man, goodness gracious, I am so over Cinnamon Toast Crunch right now. Ooh. I just gotta say, Cinnamon Toast Crunch is one of my favorite cereals growing up, but right now it feels like it's the last thing I ever want to think about. But that is actually really good. Cinnamon Toast Crunch spread. I have the cinnamon dust right here, and I have the original cinnamon toast crunch. I have four minutes left. Get out of my sight. Whew. These overload challenges just get absolutely insane. You guys gotta comment down below for whatever you want to see for the next overload challenge. Oh man. Final push. I don't even know how I'm gonna be able to use this cinnamon dust. Desperate times call for desperate measures. I've done worse, all right? Just a little bit more, just a little bit. I'm 100% gonna regret this tomorrow morning. And unfortunately, everybody, it looks like I've reached the hour mark. Oh my goodness, I feel like I've just taken a bath in cinnamon sugar. Fortunately, everyone, it looks like I failed the challenge, which means that I'm gonna have to live off a of cinnamon toast crunch for the next 48 hours. One hour post-challenge. It was time to check my blood sugar. After 14,000 straight calories of cinnamon toast crunch, I really can't say I was surprised. Yeah, that cinnamon toast was definitely a bad move. Now, after challenges like this, I usually feel like a human water balloon. So my protocol is usually to shed as much water as I can, which means exercise and sauna. Oh, goodness. I literally feel like I'm sweating cinnamon toast crunch right now. After the sauna, it was time to go to the grocery store to shop for meal number one. I almost can't even look at it. Just looking at the box is repulsive. Can't do it. Oh, I just can't do it. What I can do though is go after some of this Dolce de Leche Toast Crunch. It's still a cinnamon toast crunch product. It barely has any cinnamon flavor in it, which is what's making me the most repulsed right now. Cheers. Mm -hmm. 
I would do anything to make this bowl a giant bowl of chicken salad. Alright, a few hundred calories of cereal is about all I need. I'm going to bed. The next day was a lot better. I felt a lot less like a human water balloon. A big reason why is because of my exercise level and because I eat once per day, and it's usually at night. Let's see if I can handle this. Not as bad as yesterday. All right, well, it's gonna be a long time before I eat the cinnamon toast crunch. And at almost 48 hours post challenge, my blood sugar levels were back in the normal range. If you thought this challenge was insane, check out the Cinnabon Overload Challenge, which is gonna be right up on your screen. I'm also gonna put last week's insane challenge right up on the screen as well for you to enjoy. If you're new around here and love food challenges, don't forget to subscribe, smash that like button, and I'll see you all in the next food challenge.